uh, just a quick little video about these SD cards from the cameras. I'm having a problem with the new release from Apple, the Big Sur, in the sidebar, having these suckers show up under devices, you know. All the rest are showing up fine. So I'm just going to show you what the problem is. And there's a quick fix or a quick workaround, let's say, if that like that. It's pretty easy. And hopefully Apple fixes this little snafu. Of course, Big Sur is going to have a couple small things. For the rest, Big Sur is working great. So, you know, iMovie's working fine. Keynote, mail. Uh, mail, I'm having a little bit of issues. Mail, I'm having a bit of issues, a bit of sluggishness. I'm hoping it's just an indexing problem that will go away. Would you like when problems just go away? Anyway, let's go check it out. All right, so here we are over on uh, Big Sur. Let me get some of this stuff out of the way here. What I mean is then if you go into, you know, Finder window, and you basically see here, Uh, all your device, your locations, and your devices if you insert something. So if I insert a media disc, my Sony AX53, got the SD card, and put it in the in the card reader, and uh, over to my Finder window, should show up down here, right? So I'm popping it in, right? And now. And we don't see it, but we did see it pop in up here. Very irritating. It's it's a it's a bug. It's a snafu. Now, if the if the disc has a name like Nikon or whatever, or, or, or you have named it, it does show up down here. And the trick is the workaround is is to rename this. So if you know, if, uh, I'm using the same one over and over. So I'm just going to call this Sony. Hey, that worked. Those things are fancy now. It's still not showing up, but if I now eject it, I take it out of the card reader on the side and the USB-C in the, in the card reader. I can't show it to you because it's connected to another external screen so easily, but you know, one of those standard card readers. Put it back in, and look at that. Now it shows up. So the trick is simply rename it, and then you can get to your, to your data. You can also then obviously click on your desktop. And then, you know, if you're in um, iMovie or Premiere Pro, whatever it might be, it, it'll, it'll import anyway, but now you can at least see it in your sidebar. So that's the solution to fix this little, little snafu. Uh, by the way, just so you know, the way you, custom, you can customize the sidebar in general, you know, the whole thing, and that's under uh, Finder Preferences. There you can see um, everything, and you see everything's included here for it to show up. External disks, that would be the SD cards, hard disks, CDs, etc. So this is where you can, you know, add stuff in there if you want to add in music, take away music, pictures, etc. You can also ban things from the desktop, or let them be shown in the desktop. 